Hi, so another tip for the higher graphic communication exam, um, you need to also know about um, 3D modeling edits. So they, those are all contained within this edits tool here. And the sort of two new ones you need to know about is fillets and chamfers, but instead of regular, irregular. So a regular fillet um, is when you click on the edge using the fillet tool and it makes it the whole profile across the way is all two millimeters. That's a normal fillet tool and you could just hit apply and that would now make this have a rounded edge there. Irregular fillet it just means that it's not the same size of fillet the full way across or not the same chamfer of the full way across. So if I tick upon variable I can now click on this and you can see it's got start point and end point. So I can say okay I want you to start along here at two millimeters but I want you to end and be eight millimeters. And you can now see with the preview that it starts off as two and it gets wider and wider as it works its way across. Um, so it's a larger filleted area. Um, so that would be an irregular fillet. And again, if you know, I've hit apply and okay, you can see it here, I'd highlight you dread this. Um, a bigger area, a bigger fillet. So this could be handy if you're having sort of want to make a more freeform shape or a bigger curve um, or a more interesting counter or something like that. Um, so that's irregular fillets. And the regular chamfer tool works the same that you could have instead of um, it being equal on both distances, obviously this is going to be the same distance both ways. With the chamfer tool you can have it so it's wider across the top or wider across the bottom. So changing the angle that the chamfer is at rather than the standard 45 degrees you could have it more one way or more the other way. So that's irregular chamfers and irregular fillets.